Hey guys, in this video, we're gonna talk about can you buy a rental property with an FHA loan? Coming up. All right, so can you buy a rental property with an FHA loan? And the answer is, it depends. You can't use an FHA loan to buy a property that you don't intend to occupy. FHA loans are designed to help people buy a property as a primary residence and move into it. And in fact, I don't believe you can have more than one FHA loan at a time. So the benefits of an FHA loan is it's a government-backed loan that will allow you to put down a very small amount of money, often as low as three and a half percent. So if you were gonna buy a property worth, let's say $100,000 and you could get the FHA loan and you could do it with only 3.5% down, that means you could get into that home with only $3,500 out of pocket, plus the cost of closing and whatnot, but the government and the lender would lend you the other 90, what is that, 96.5%, I think. Not the best with the simple math here, guys. But that is what it's designed to do. So can you use an FHA loan to buy a rent? rental property. Well, if you intend to live in the property, then the answer is yes. And this is essentially called house hacking. So if you were to buy, let's say a four bedroom property and use an FHA loan and you moved into one of those bedrooms, there's no law stating that you can't rent out the other bedrooms. And a lot of people love to use this strategy with duplexes, triplexes, and even quadruplexes. You can use an FHA loan to buy a duplex or a triplex or a quadruplex as long as you intend to occupy occupy one of those units. But just like the bedroom scenario when it came to house hacking, you can rent out the additional units as long as you are living in one of those units. Now, I know of people that have used an FHA loan to buy a property, a single family and rent out the other rooms, or to buy a multifamily and rent out the other units. And they've lived there for a year or two, and then they decided that they didn't want to live there anymore, and they moved. And they rented out the entire property. And that's okay, but it's not designed for you to buy a property and not live in it. It's really designed as an FHA loan product for you to live there. Now, how long you live there is really up to you. So I wouldn't suggest you move in for a day or a week or even a month because you could maybe essentially get in some trouble for getting a loan to buy a property that you don't intend to occupy. But you know, after a year or two, if you decide you want to upgrade or move somewhere else and keep that existing financing in place, you are welcome to move out and rent all those units. The downside to that is, is you're not gonna be able to use another FHA loan unless you refinance out of the existing loan. You can only have one at a time. So it's a little bit of a complicated answer today, but as long as you intend to occupy one of the rooms or one of the units in the property that you are buying, you can use an FHA loan to do so and rent out the additional rooms or the additional units. I hope you guys learned something and hopefully I answered the question that you had about using FHA loan to buy rental properties. Guys, don't forget, like the video, help me reach a wider audience, and subscribe if you wanna see more videos just like this. Thanks for watching. Signing off.